Well, it's pouring down rain. And I thought that since the donkeys had been taking care of Goose, that they would let him in the stall because they've done everything else with him. But I look out here and here's Goose. Come on, Goose, let's go. Come on, let's go, Goose. Let's go see Daddy Malibu. Come on, let's go see Daddy Malibu. Come on, Goosey. Alrighty, come on, let's go. Y'all, Goose is so cute with all his little fluff going away. Look at him, y'all. I thought them old girls would take care of him. He's stuck to the bone. Malibu, come get your baby. Here he is. Barbie was so concerned. She ran over there to him and was screaming at me to get him. Because, you know, I know I'm bringing your baby. I'm bringing y'all's baby. So, if you're going to ask why I had him in there, it was because he was eating their feed and it was making him so fat that it was going to cause him health issues. But for today, and when it rains, he'll go with his, his daddy Malibu and mama Barbie because they take way better care of him. Come on, Goosey. It's okay, buddy. You wanna just go through that gate? I got everybody their breakfast. Goose is back with Malibu. He is one happy camper. I need to check underneath that blanket. Make sure, Barbie, I'm sorry. Goosey, let me just reach up underneath here. Nope, you're not gonna let me do that. All right. I just need to see if it's warm under there and dry, Goose. Nice and dry. That's all you gotta worry about. You know, he had pneumonia, so I gotta make sure that he stays somewhat dry. I did not, I really thought those girls would let him in there to eat and stay with him in the stall, but apparently not. Good morning. Duncan, y'all, it is pouring down out there. We yesterday we spent, excuse the messy head. Yesterday we spent doing a lot of chores. Good morning, Duncan. Good morning, Tamale. I have fallen in love with both of these horses, but this guy is so sweet. Let me get his food. The weather seems to be getting a lot worse. So I'm going to take my butt back in the house. Everybody's been fed. He needs to be brushed. But everybody's been fed. I've done all I can do. I'm happy to know that old Goosey's nice and dry now. Barbie's happy to have her little baby back. I'm sorry, you don't like the camera in your face. Malibu's happy to have him back. And they'll be happy till about... 4 or 5 of p.m. tonight when it's feed time and he's aggravating them. They've already had breakfast so he can't aggravate them. Now they're just eating their brunch. And if you're going to ask how many times a day do you feed the horses, I feed minimal twice a day and that's for horses that are good weight and that's just grain. And then I'll throw hay throughout the day, alfalfa throughout the day. I, like, for instance, for, uh, <coughs> excuse me. Everybody's been saying, I hope you get better. I had walking pneumonia for like two months, so I just got this lingering cough. But for tamale, tamale, come on up here. Uh, tamale gets fed four times during the day because oh you two be nice to each other y'all have enough hay so that's something you definitely gonna have to deal with with see we're we're talking mean to each other right now because they don't want to share hay which they don't have to but they're not sure about that they've probably had to fight for it but the weather's getting worse and ashley and elijah are waiting inside on me so i'm gonna cut this off and head on in y'all have a good day